Okay, so what happened in the last... How many weeks have it, has it been? A month? <laughs> yeah. Let me get my fun juice. Because we're going to have some fun. Mm. Also, don't worry about the little spots here. These were mosquitoes. It's it's this I, I stress the word where <laughs> they were mosquitoes. <laughs> yeah, how do I start? <laughs> so I have been away because, um, as I said, I haven't been do been doing so great because um, someone uh, out of, from my family died. And that just knocked me the hell over. I couldn't do anything. Like, I've been just trying to cope with that. Not doing well. Not doing well. <laughs> yeah. Um, my horse got ill. Which is also great, really great, um, because we don't really know why, like, wh whatever is happening, we don't know. Um, someone I know for, I knew, already knew for a long time, uh, got into the hospital because they um, were doing really bad, just in general. They uh, were really tired all the time, they couldn't walk all that much anymore without getting totally exhausted and they got into the hospital and um yeah we still don't really know what they have <laughs> it's just um it's just great because the first diagnosis that we were given was leukemia or leukemia i don't know how you pronounce that in english great really great <laughs> No, I'm sorry. I am really sarcastic right now because um, this is all really bad. This is not fun. And my coping mechanism with these things is just to make jokes all the time because I can't really cope with the real emotion of just sadness and helplessness that I'm feeling right now. <laughs> I'm really frustrated because just all around me is just death and cancer and illness and it feels shit it really feels shit well with the person i just talked about maybe they just can't eat gluten or something that's also a thing the doctor said so who knows right <laughs> it's like the same thing having not being able to eat gluten and fucking blood cancer good Thank you for that diagnosis. Thank you. Yeah, I'm really frustrated with myself because I have a feeling that I have to be like 100% all the time and I can't really do that right now. Uh, my stomach is acting up again really badly. <laughs> you know, I have this fucking phrase that I always like to say life is too short to be worried about blood in your shit <laughs> because you should be worried when there's blood in your shit let's just I'll just leave this here you can take anything out of that just as you want I um, started taking medication for that uh, they kind of work, but they also made me feel weird. And this kind of medication isn't supposed to be taken for a long time because um, then it will actually destroy your stomach more than help it. So, yeah, <laughs> I don't have the medication now. Doing worse again. Well, <laughs> yeah, school has been going fine I guess 
I'm not as good as I want to be. But also I have the feeling like I can't learn because every time I try to learn, my brain gets overloaded. And um, yeah, so I feel really lazy and just really bad. Also, my hair is still wet because I took a shower, which was the first shower I took in like six days. <laughs> I haven't had a shower in the last six days. <laughs> Nearly got to Bo Burnham's song. Nearly did it, Bo. Nearly did it. Uh huh. Yeah, there's just a lot of pent up anger and frustration, and so I kind of lash out all the time right now, which sucks because I feel like a fucking asshole. <laughs> yeah. I, I can't do anything more than to say I'm sorry and try to explain my situation not as like an excuse for doing that behavior it's not okay to lash out at people just because you're angry and feel helpless and actually just need some comfort but are unable to ask for comfort yeah that's not an excuse to act shitty I still gotta show that you know that you're you're the problem but can't do anything else than to try and better myself but it's not really working right now and yeah that's that's also very frustrating yeah also i um i had a a, um, a topic i always wanted to talk about but never did because i thought um that that not that that's too intimate because I'm not a person to really keep like good borders on what is too intimate and what isn't um but I think for me at least I have come to the conclusion that it would be good to talk about that topic because it's a topic that isn't talked about too much or isn't really brought to attention too much in a good way because um, it is about mental illness um, and it's something really common but it's always just like overlooked because it's really common <laughs> and uh, yeah I just wanted to talk about that because I think that it's good to talk about stuff like that also for me, just to get it out there and just to kind of, I don't really, I can't really explain what it, I just know that it will kind of help me to talk about that and to be open about that because I think it's something that shouldn't be just pushed away and pushed out of the light because like, oh no, mental illness, let's not talk about that because that's weird. <laughs> that's stupid. Just to tell you that's stupid if you think that way. Mental illness is the same as physical illness. It's illness, okay? So, yeah. Yeah, so um, that's a little part of what's been going on in my life. I have so many videos just really, like, just so fucking ready to post. But I was really, really not feeling it. So, yeah, I didn't post. Um, I have a Minecraft server, which just, I'll go play on that Minecraft server now. So, um, yeah, I'll do that. Um, I'll probably, some at some point, I will just film some videos on there because that's what I wanted to do there. But right now is not the time. <laughs> right now is the time to just kind of get a clearer head and... I don't know. Not end, end things. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah. Thanks for watching. Just a little update. Yeah. <gasps> Fuck! Sorry, I just remembered that I wanted to drink pumpkin spice latte <laughs> for this video. <laughs> just to try it out. <laughs> because it's always like I never I never tried that kind of stuff. I don't know what pumpkin spice tastes like. I hope it tastes like pumpkin because that would make sense, but 
I don't know. I wanted to try that out, but now the whole joke is just gone. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> oh. Well, at least this is orange, so kind of Halloween themed. Oh, and I'm wearing a onesie, so this is this is totally a Halloween video. See? Haha. -ha. Just to end on a good note. I've met a person that is really cool and I'm going to meet them tomorrow on Halloween, like not really on Halloween, like kind of on Halloween because we're going to a party which is going to like party through to Halloween. So, are you into Halloween? I don't know what's the, wh how to say that. I'm German. I have bad pronunciation and vocabulary and grammar, so yeah. <laughs> No, but that's great. Um, my best friend Kat is really cool. I love her. She's so cool. Don't know what to tell you. <laughs> good things, good things. Bye. <laughs>